be showing you guys one of my gifts I got from my girl on Christmas. I'm at Emancipation Park, as you guys can see. It's a nice world, little area. Has a lot of little space where I can fly, fly this drone. Now, I've been wanting to fly, but I was a little under the weather. I've been sick and been working, and now the weather is getting right, and I actually have time to fly today. So I'm gonna give you guys a little demo on what I got, but first I'm gonna go ahead and show you what I got. So when I got it, it comes this color, but I added this and the propellers is a DJI drone. From what I've seen, it has a 2K, 2.7K camera. Um, it looked like the range is, from what I saw, the farthest someone took is about three and a half miles so far. And that was without a range extender. I have a range extender, which is in here. This is the controller. It comes with this, just the controller and just the, as you can see, just the body. The red and all this is extra. The base, all this is the dust shield. This is the landing, the landing pad. If I can do this, I'm trying to do this look. Just me out here today. So this is the base, this is the landing pad. It goes like this. I'm gonna put it on the blue side today. Okay. All right. I'll be back in just a moment because I actually have to use my phone to guide it for the screen. So the phone is the eyes for this. As you can see, this is the drone. And it's like an Android charger. It takes about I want to say an hour and 20 minutes to charge and it goes about 25 to 30 minutes which is really long for a drone as you can see it's like my hands bigger than it but it's real powerful Okay, so look, I took it up in the air. You like, you know what I like about this drone? Like the camera is wonderful in their views. I really can't wait to start shooting like short films and videos using these shots. Like I have so many ideas that I wanna shoot. Like I just can't wait. Y'all gonna just have to just stay tuned to the channel because I'm going to be posting all of that. Like, I have people working on some scripts right now that I'm going to be collaborating with. But besides that, so this park is Emancipation Park. As you can see, it's a new park. Like, I don't know when it got there. I found it on accident because for those that know and those that don't know, I'm a vegan. So we recently went to Austin and they have so many different vegan options out there and desserts like one of the few things i haven't been able to eat since i became vegan is like strawberries like baked stuff so i googled it and they had like a strawberry cupcake it's this place called crumbles it's literally right across the street i'm gonna run you about like six dollars for a cupcake but it was it was good it was worth it and then I found out that vegan soul food is right across the street as well. Like right over there, actually. Um, so you guys can see it has a steady shot. It can fly really fast. Like this is on, there's three different modes, but this is on the regular mode. So it's not, it's not moving that fast anyway. I'm just trying to get the view. But it goes about 28 miles per hour. But I'm loving the view that it takes. It's like, 
is wonderful. I love it. But as you guys can see, this is like a really brand new park. You could do everything in here. They got a tennis court, a basketball court, a baseball field, a swimming pool, a theater, a playground. The only thing they're really missing is like, I would say like a track with people. I've seen people running around. They even got rocking chairs. They got outlets where you can plug in stuff. So you can really do all types of stuff at this park. All oh, this, and this is the view. I had to stop it right here because the view. I actually live downtown over there. So that's why I stopped and took that picture. But as y'all see, y'all should really go ahead and get one of these. It's a DJI drone. The base model is going to cost you about 400 to 500 depending on the little add-ons you get. But after you start buying stuff from it, the price can go up a little bit. I bought a few things for it. I'm impressed. Cause you get, you definitely get your dollars worth with this drone. Definitely. Like, I love it. I don't have no issues with it. Only issue I had so far, but I think it was caused by me. I changed the propellers as y'all about to find out. When I pushed the return from home button, I, tr I noticed it wasn't going exactly where it took off from, so I tried to take control of it. And I guess one of the propellers wasn't screwed in all the way. As soon as I did, it did some type of malfunction, and it just, one of the blades, I found out later that one of the propellers fell off. And it just, caused it to crash and go down. It went down pretty quick. It's about to go down, as y'all about to see very shortly. But if you guys want to see me take any views of Houston, just put in the comments down below. I'll be more than happy to go and take some shots for y'all and post it. Y'all can use it or whatever. Do what y'all need to do. But now I'm just going to let y'all enjoy the rest of the flight. Well, it's coming to an end right now, actually. But go ahead. Like, comment, subscribe. So, it crashed because of wing or something. I lost the wing. As you can see, it's missing the wing right here. Luckily, it landed over here on this grass. Oh, there's the piece I was looking for. But yeah, I pushed the return back home button when it was about kind of like... 20 feet. Oh, actually, no. It was way up there. It was probably about. It was probably about. Maybe like 75 feet in the air. <laughs> I stopped it because it looked like it was about to hit these trees right here. It was supposed to land right there. And then all of a sudden, it, it did its own thing and said no. <laughs> and it just went all crazy. I couldn't catch it because. But it did it veered off this way and then it fell right here. Boom. Oh man, the thing is still intact. You know, I got a couple of, uh, I guess that's what the propeller hit. Oh uh, yeah, huh. The propeller hit right there. That's what happened. Ain't nothing the skin won't fix, but yeah. I'm putting it in for the day. <laughs>